guys and welcome back to my channel and happy 2022 uh this is going to be the first video i'm gonna say vlog first video of the year and today's video is gonna be a goals i guess what i'm trying to achieve in 2022 if you're new here my name is Mai. i am an online reseller i sell on the platforms poshmark and mercari we're trying to step our little toes in with ebay as well as depop so we're just growing here we're growing all together here um but today's video like i said is a goals video so if you're new here want to see more reseller content don't forget to subscribe down below it really does help me out and i'd really appreciate it but let's get started with the video so like i said today's is goals now i did not make a big overthought like i didn't want to overthink it I guess is just like the straight way to say it. Um, so I wrote down, it's technically three goals. I know it doesn't sound like a lot, but like if I throw myself into being like, I want to do this, 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 and give myself like a list of 100 things, I'm going to tell you right now, it's just not going to happen. No way in fucking hell is it going to happen. It's just, no. So we wrote down a couple. But like for two of my goals, I realized that it kind of fell under an umbrella of one thing so i just put it under there let's just get started so the first goal that i have on my list is my death pile now if you're new to the reselling world or just never have heard the term death pile some people also say money pile it's just the list just the, all the items that you have yet to photograph and list that are just sitting there so people call it a money pile because it is literally just your money sitting there um, it's not listed on any platform, so there's no way it can sell, or your death pile because it's just kind of there. Um, my goal is to not have one. Currently, I have one. Um, so I need to get started on racking that out. Most of my death pile slash money pile is actually my TLC pile. It's like things that just have like a tiny little mark that I've noticed while I photograph, or just like if they need a fabric shaver, you know, like need some little love and TLC. So that's what most of my death pile is. Um, this is part of it, but this I just got and is a haul. So like these items I don't consider, like yes, it is part of my death pile, but in this sense, I don't consider it because like it's a process to get all this done and I just got it. So you know, you buy it, you do YouTube, <laughs> you do a YouTube video on it, you do Instagram posts, um, what else? I need to clean some of this stuff, I've already put it in inventory, that, that type of stuff. It's like, this is in the process, that death pile that I'm specifically talking about is literally just sitting there. Like, I'm surprised it's even in my Excel sheet, like, yeah. So, the goal for 2022 is to not have one, just, just straight, no. You buy something, you do, the, if it needs to be hauled, you know, if I want to make a haul on it on YouTube, I do my haul video, I put it in my inventory, I clean what needs to be cleaned right away, you know, I don't wait for like this pile to like come up, and then I photograph it and I list it, like that's it, put it away, wait for it to sell, ship it out, there's no waiting three months because I want my laundry pile to go, no, no, get the shit out and rolling. Um, my second goal, so this second goal is the umbrella goal, I guess is what we're going to call it. So, two of my main goals for this year is, one, to be monetized on YouTube. So, like I said before, subscribe down below. You'll really help me out with that goal. Um, so, I want to be monetized on YouTube. I am very far away from it. I started this YouTube channel last year, and I was not very consistent. Um, so, that is my goal for this year. And my second goal that falls under this second goal umbrella is to increase my sales every month. So, you know... January I might do $100, then, you know, 105 then 102 like, no, not 102 that's going down. It's, you know, just keep on going each month. I'm not exactly, not at this moment exactly putting, like, a mark on it. Like, it has to be, like, 50 times more, double. No, no, just, you know, every month growing more. And that's really the whole point of that goal is just to continuously grow. It doesn't necessarily mean with inventory because I can't exactly hold more inventory. I think I've reach my max or almost reach my max with um, the amount of inventory I can have in this house um so it's really just about getting things going moving cross-listing um 
so more eyes can see it, do flea markets to get things moving, you know, each month increase the revenue and the profits that are coming in. So that is two. So those two, if you didn't catch me already say the word, is under my consistency goal. So my goals for like to be able to like get those things, because I can say it as much as I want, these are my goals, but if I don't actually have a plan on how I'm going to do it, all it is is a goal and it's not going to get anywhere. So like I said with the death pile, you know, you buy it, you list it, you do YouTube videos, you know, like that is my process that I'm going to try to follow. With this, it's going to be most, like I have that same type of process. So to be monetized, you know, to be, you need to be consistent on YouTube so the algorithm likes you. Um, my plan at this moment is to upload every Tuesday and Thursday. Tuesday, Thursday, Tuesday, Thursday, Tuesday, Thursday. That is my goal, my plan for the year. Another thing to, that I want to get done for, not get done, another thing that is part of my plan with getting monetized on YouTube is to actually like post about it, I guess. That sounds kind of weird. Um, but at the beginning of my YouTube journey, I guess you can say, I never post about it on my Instagram. I just kind of upload videos and every once in a while I'd post about it, but I can't upload a new video. Um, but I actually want to be uploading, you know, like a post feed or something be like, hey, here's my channel, hey, here's my channel, on my story, on my post, mention it to other people I'm talking to them, find more reseller YouTubes and stuff like that so we can connect and everything. Because um, one, networking is really important, and two, you have to show some something to someone like five or six times for them to actually take action. So feed posts, stories, talk to them about it, you know, you gotta get to move on. And then the increased sales, I want to, to be consistent with that, you got to, like I said, I'm kind of like max on inventory, um, just space-wise. So I really do want to do more flea markets this year because that was a fun little thing to find out to do. Um, but also cross-listing, I'm currently cross-listing onto Depop, some items, Mercari, some items which Mercari want to have like just the same amount of items and the same items I have on Poshmark onto Mercari because um, when I find when I do list on Mercari I do get sales so that's how we increase our revenue but I gotta actually do it I can't just say it okay and then the third goal for the the, the third goal for I would say the month but for the year um, is kind of just to be more me I guess Sounds a little weird, um, but I saw someone else, I don't remember if there was the goal videos or an Instagram post, I think it was an Instagram post, um, and when I read it, I was like, you're completely right, because I'm trying to curate my Instagram, making it all neutrals, or making it all this, making it all that, and then I get bored of it, and then I get burnt out really quickly, or I'm like, oh, I can only get high-end brands, because, you know, we want a higher revenue, blah, 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 this, and then again, I get tired of it, and I get burnt out, so... Okay, we switched to my phone because my SD card ran out of memory. Um, but like I was saying with my third girl about just like being more about me, um, yeah, I try to curate things and then I get extremely tired and I get burnt out and I don't want to do it anymore. So F that and we're just going to buy whatever we want, post whatever we want and that's about it. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect lighting. Like, yeah, I like it to have nice lighting. My hair right there is standing up. But usually, like, if something like this happened, I would want to refilm it because I don't want to upload it because, oh, my God, my SD card ran out of battery. No, no, no. Just upload the goddamn video. Like, that. that's it. Just. Yeah. So, yes, that is my video for today. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Let me know what your goals are down below, whether it's personal, whether it is for your business. Yes, I hope you guys enjoyed listening to my goals for the year. We'll probably do like a retake on this at the end of the year to kind of see like what actually happened. How did we get things? Did we accomplish things? We'll see. But thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe down below so I can get monetized at some point in the year. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.